Hey y'all. So today I am going to um, attempt to build my dream apartment. I'm feeling heavily inspired by the pastel pop kit and I want to see what I can make with this. I'm pretty excited. Okay, so I've loaded into this apartment. I've cleared all the walls, made the walls white, just changed the floors. My first apartment really did look like that. <laughs> it had that like shag carpet. Anyways, I've lived in my fair share of apartments and I know what I like and I know what I don't like. And I don't like carpet, so I'm not putting that in there. I would have wood floors and they'd be nice. This is literally like what my floors look like now. <laughs> I did choose these floors, so not a huge surprise there. Something else that I really, really loved that I saw in a couple of apartments, they had like, not full blown offices, but like office nooks. So basically it would be like a little room like this that didn't have a door, but had an arch. And it was really cute. I thought it was really cozy. Obviously you don't get like a ton of privacy like you would in a normal office, but like I thought it was really sweet. So you'd have like a big arch and then in this room, the ones I've seen were like this. They were really tiny, but this is a dream apartment, which means we can make it a little bit bigger. I need to put some lights in this place, but like, look at these watches. Ah! I haven't actually built with this kit yet, so I'm really excited. Let me go ahead and plan out the floor plan so I can put lights down before I do the rest of this. This would be a good spot, I think for a dining room. I'd like to have like maybe this could either be the kitchen or the living room. I don't know. We could do full open floor plan where we have kitchen, dining, and then like this could be the living room like with the TV on this wall. We could definitely go for something like that and then I could make this a room. Cause I'm trying to utilize these windows, right? Like this is beautiful over here. And like this could be a room, which I think that's how the original floor plan was, but we'll make it a little bit bigger. I am starting to wonder if this is gonna be too big of a kitchen. No, let's see. This might actually be perfect, but then that does leave a a lot of empty space. So maybe we make this office a little bit bigger. Maybe we make it like an actual office or something. Oh, uh, you know what? Bestie, you know what I forgot in this house? A bathroom. Didn't even think about it. How did I forget that? That's kind of funny. I constantly forget about bathrooms. It's like they don't even exist to me. Okay, a lot has happened. My whole little plan of like an office nook is gone. Basically trying to fit two bathrooms in here. I don't know if that's fully necessary, but as a dream apartment, let me tell you something that I hate. I once lived with someone and we had one bathroom and it was a nightmare. I do not recommend. So my dream apartment would have two at the least. This is not a want, it is a need. However, I did originally put it here, but then I was like, where's the kitchen gonna go? So I ended up giving this room its own ensuite and then putting one in the hallway here. They're both full baths so that this person has their own shower. That leaves this huge room. Um, the thing is, right, like I could make it like that and have a bigger like kitchen, but then like, what? I don't know. So like this made more sense to me, but let's try with it. Let's do the kitchen. Let's see if it looks weird. My original kitchen looked really cute, I thought. It's just it's gonna have to be smaller, I think. I mean, we could do something like that with an island. Not like super sold on it though. I mean, this isn't bad, it's just it's just small. Let's try to mix this around a little bit. If I do something like this, maybe I put the living room here instead. I can have this little spot right here. We could put a bookshelf there. It would look really nice and fit perfectly. I'd say we could also put this in there, but it's gonna have a chair, so. This is actually one of my favorite things in the world when houses have like little, little niche areas and you can, oh, it fits, oh my God, oh. It's so cute. This is kind of sad because it like blocks the really cute detail on the side, but like it does fit in the spot. I love that blue. Oh, so cute. That's just nice because it just like fits so snug as a bug in a rug. Okay, this might work a little bit better. And then instead of maybe having a round dining room table, we can just have like a shorter one. Don't go too crazy. Maybe I'll get a love seat. There we go. That looks nice. I think I could probably also have an island, but I don't know if that's... Is that too much? Is that too much? I mean, especially if I have bar stools, like is that just too much seating all too close to each other or is that like okay but i feel like without an island it looks super duper weird let's like put the fridge over there maybe is there enough room for your sims to like walk around there should be i mean this is nice because then you have a perfect spot for a sink and a perfect spot for a stove, it's just kind of slim. I don't know if having one island would look weird. It does, it does. Maybe I had it right the first time because then what I could do is put the oven on this side where there's a little more room and then put the sink over here, like maybe there. Could scooch it over a little bit, but I think that's probably the best we're gonna do. And then we'll put a trash can over here. Oh, that's so cute. Cute! Oh, these are trash cans. Oh my God, oh, the cat one, shut your mouth, shut up. I gotta do the pink cow print though. I think that's so cute. Okay, so I think this is the general layout. We've got two bedrooms, one really, this is, this, 
But I might like actually make this bedroom a little smaller. Like, it, like who does it think it is? I'll bump it out a little. Yeah, because I want the hallway to be like nice and big. Oh, you know what? My only other issue, hold on. We might redo this whole office situation because I'm starting to wonder if I should like put the living room on this side. So like build out the little office like this. But I can't move this stupid window. Okay, maybe like this. Because I'd love to put in a fireplace. I love fireplaces. Like, oh, I just think they make any room look so nice. One that I can put a TV above, obviously, this being the living room. We could have a giant one. I'm happy with that. Oh, I like that swatch. That's nice. We're gonna have a TV above that. This fireplace, like, it makes these TVs look like they're tiny. <laughs> this TV is normally fine. I need, like, an IMAX theater in here. Oh, wait, this TV works. That looks really goofy, though, in my opinion. Maybe we don't do the... A super huge fireplace because that was just throwing me off. Oh, that's cute. Especially if we do have a, like a lot of pastels. That'll look nice. Ooh, oh my gosh, so cute. This would be really good for an entryway table. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Let's do this for an end table. Maybe we can match the blue. Oh, I guess it technically matches the yellow. I'll change the couches in a second too. And obviously the wallpaper is a hot mess. I don't know if I'm gonna keep this wallpaper or not. It's just like a placeholder. We also need tile in the bathrooms. And we can put that new like shaggy carpet in the bedrooms. That might be kind of fun. Oh, look at all the cute swatches. What? What the heck? Oh my God. Those are so fun. My eyes. I love this one. That is actually so cute. It looks so plush, doesn't it? <laughs> Maybe in here I can do the fun, uh, <laughs> the fun pink carpet. That's fun. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do the carpets in there. I think that's pretty fun. You know what? This would be really, really good if you were trying to make like a carpet rug. If you were like on a budget. You could do one of those. It's a rug. Who's going to know? It also came with really cute wallpaper. Would my dream apartment have this wallpaper? It might actually. Yeah. <laughs> what else do we got? Oh my gosh. It also just comes with beautiful solid pastel wallpapers. Thank you. They're gorgeous. They're gorgeous. I do love a good simple wallpaper sometimes. I really do. That's really cute. Like the accent wall. I love that. I mean, I could do blue, but it gets a little bit lost. I like the pink and the blue. I mean, I really don't care. Oh, love this. Looks like my switch controller with the pink and the blue. Okay, so this, I found like the matching one with like really similar baseboards that's also just white if I want to like make the rest of it white so it's not all pink. Because I think the pink Pink looks really cute over here, but I don't want to overdo it. I might have a little mix match moment here. Maybe I'll bring it into the kitchen. It is cute. It is really cute. Shoot, I don't know. Maybe I lied. Maybe I will make the whole thing pink. This is a nice pink. It's like a peachy pink. Okay, I'm gonna do some accent walls there, there, and there. And this might be a little much for some of you, but not for me. I could do more. So with this table, ooh, what color do I want to do? Ooh, I like the green. It does make me think of like watermelon or strawberries, which is on brand. Oh, this is perfect for an entryway. Hello. Hang up your little purse and your keys. Oh my gosh, the colors are so cute. This is gonna be a very multicolored apartment. It's gonna be fun because I want to have fun. And also look at this really cool mirror. Oh, this mirror is so cool. Oh, clutter. This is such a good time to have clutter. Perfect. Look at this. Stunning. What else can we put right here? Oh, a phone, some glasses, a notebook. That's cute. Oh my gosh. Is that like a little board to pin stuff on? Put that in the office. It's perfect in there. Okay, we also, ooh, okay, the bags. That's a good one too. Rugs, cute cookie rug. Everybody stop talking for one second. No, shut up. <gasps> this is actually a joke. That is actually so cute. It matches the trash can. Maybe I can use it in here. I gotta use it somewhere. It's gorgeous. Ooh, that's the one. Okay, I'll put down some more clutter. I'll put some shoes underneath. I think that looks pretty realistic. Very cute. Oh my God, I can put stuff on here. Makeup brushes for on the way out. This is a tie between using this one and the one that came with the kit. It's a bit of a tie for me. I feel like I should use this one though. It's new, it's fresh. Oh my God, and it came with a chair. A heart chair. Oh, look at these prints. God, these are so cute. That one kind of matches the rug. I think I should, do, I'll do the cow print on this one. What do we have in love? Oh, I'm gonna throw up. This is so cute. What the heck is this? It's like shelves. I actually kind of wish my house was this stylish. I think it's, this is such a cool style. I'll put a little plant in there. Classic. I could put some mugs in here. Everything else that has to be in here has to be like really, really 
small. I'm trying to find things that fit in there. It is not much, let me tell you. Oh, okay, some books. Happy to have those in there. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, look at this computer. It looks like my setup. I've got like the long, cute mouse pad. Oh my gosh, the swatches are amazing. Honestly, I'm gonna go with the default swatch. I really, really like it. We'll put some flowers there. Ooh, a hanging plant would be cute here. Maybe above this chair. Oh, love it. I think a nice candle or lamp or something would be cute. Oh my gosh, I forgot about these candles. Okay, uh, you leave. You, you're here. Oh my gosh, they're so cool. I completely forgot about those for a second. All right, what else can I put on a desk? My go-to is just plants, always. I just always go for plants. They look so good. Okay, well, this is a perfect item. Gonna have to raise it up though. Okay, I have cheated it up here and it looks cute. It looks really cute. Okay, perfect, perfect. I think having like a little ottoman or something to sit on would be really cute right here. Or like a little poof. Or even just, oh, this chair would be cute in here. I love little teddy bear. Okay, I do still wanna get that bookshelf. I know I don't have a little spot for it anymore. It was a great idea while I lasted, but it's gone now. But at least we can see the sides. A happy ending. And then honestly, just something on the wall over here would be perfect. I think this actually fits the color scheme pretty well. So we will go with that. Cute. I really, really like that. I would be pleased to have that as an office. I do really want a bit of an accent wall here though. Oh, but it just looks so good if I do the whole room. Okay, maybe this one. A little less harsh on the eyes. I think that one's good. I gotta leave it in there like that. It's just so much more fun. Then maybe I'll change this one to be, I don't know. I feel like I should have a different wallpaper because like, come on. It's getting a little repetitive. Why do I like the tile? I guess because it matches the tiled table. It's a little unusual though. Okay, what if I broke it up like this? <laughs> Just so when you're looking at it from this side, it's not all the same. I'm fine with that. Moving right along. Okay, I want a big plant in this corner just to fill that in. I do need something on this wall. I mean, another table would probably work. Um, I'm trying to think of something else I could use. I could put one of these over here. I always forget about these. These like big displays. Could also use one of these. Seems a bit random, seeing as it's not in a kitchen. Oh, but there's also this. This is also a really, really cool table. It just seems a little bit like small to put right in the middle, but I feel like if I put it on the side, it would look a little bit weird. Like if I did it like over here, it'd look a little bit odd. I need something on like either side of it, but I don't know what. Maybe we'll do like a green or like a purple maybe. We can put something on these tables just to frame it in. We could do plants or lamps or something. I actually might put a lamp right there. So maybe not a lamp. I don't know if this looks super goofy. It does look a little bit goofy. I thought it was gonna be like cool and creative. But now that I'm looking at it, it looks a little weird. Unless I just don't do the table and I do like two more plants. I know I have a plant right there though. So maybe I switch that out for like a mirror or something. I'd say I do like the mirror and you know the one, this bad boy. But I can't put it on an angle, which I would do if this were real life. I just put it right in the corner. But unfortunately, this is the Sims. So I have to get like one of these and put it down. Oh, this fits the aesthetic. I love that. I love that. Okay, so back to this. Okay, I saw someone do this the other day and I wish to try it. Like, that is really cute, hello. We could even make it some fun colors or like switch them up or something. Try to keep them in the pastels. That's so cute. Okay, put a painting right above that. Now we can also fit like some small items in these cubbies. I never know what to put in here though. Oh, blankets. I actually don't think that's slotting in there, but it kind of looks like it belongs there. We could just raise it up. That's perfect. It's going there. And then on this side, how about these presents? Just cause they fit so well. They fit so good. I don't know why there's presents there. Merry Christmas. Okay, next I think I just need to get a rug in here to get inspired. This is a good size rug. Not sure any of these swatches are calling out to me. I love the cheetah print one. I mean, I could do neutral rug. Okay, this is very cute. I feel like it definitely fits the aesthetic more, but it's like a lot of patterns. I think I might just have to go with, with my personal favorite, which is just the fuzzy rug. Actually the orange, it does match, but it like, I don't know. It's sending a message. I don't want to send a message. I just want to relax. God, even the fuzzy rug is not doing it for me. Uh, maybe I should just go neutral. Maybe that's the way. Cause I've got a lot of patterns on the wall 
So like choosing a rug is like becoming more and more difficult. Let's just go with that. I'll see what kind of couches we have. I know the new kit did come with a couch or with a love seat, I should say. Oh, it is cute. I don't know if I want to use a full size couch though. Maybe a full size couch is too much. It's just kind of a big space. I could just push it forward. Okay, you know what? Maybe I will do this. Obviously not that couch, but I love this couch. It's not from the kit, I don't think, but it is, it fits the aesthetic perfectly. And now I just need to find a couch that I like. Possibly this one, just cause it's pink. <laughs> it fits, it fits. Now I was wishing this had a pink swatch. Like is the blue too random? Maybe I should change this to blue or I could do that blue. No, that's too close. Oh, we still need a coffee table. Totally forgot about that. Might just keep it simple. This is my go-to coffee table. I love it. I might put the little dog on here. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Y'all mind if I get the Husky? I might be biased. Okay, this is screaming for plants over here. Y'all are gonna hate this one, but I love it. I want something really, really tall. Yeah, I want something tall. There isn't anything too tall. And these are definitely a little funky and a little wacky. So let's go with it. As for curtains in this house, I mean, these windows are just so tall. I don't know if like anything will look good. Oh, I stand corrected. That looks beautiful. Now my problem is that like, what happens when I get over to these? <sighs> they don't have a... Uh... They don't have bigger ones. Just those. I am so sad right now. Holy cow, this is so hard to find curtains for these windows. They're just like up slightly. Oh no, they're not even up that high. It's just the walls are really long and not a lot of these are made for the long walls. You can try to use these. I don't love them though. I don't love them. It's better than nothing, I guess. I mean, at least they have some wider ones. Beggars cannot be choosers, I guess. It's fine, I will live with it. Now, how am I supposed to do this window? I don't think I do. I don't think I, I do nothing. I'll just do one of these. It's so weird. Okay, so this space is like pretty open, which I mean, normally I would hate that, but honestly, I've tried a bunch of different layouts for this and I think this is the best. I'm just gonna put a giant collage of photos there because I just can't be bothered. Honestly, what I've chosen here, I like. I just need a rug. I, what I chose for the example is like, it worked out. Okay, you're gonna just keep a neutral over here too because again, lots of stuff going on. I will put a nice floral arrangement on the table. And then in here, honestly, I love these cabinets. I really, really love these cabinets. They're my favorite. I don't know what colors to do. Like, I don't know if I should go colorful with like yellow or if that, I don't know if that worked. I mean, they're, no. I mean, the green actually doesn't look bad, technically. I love this green. That's my personal fave. I'm not feeling like that's working either. I may have to choose a different cabinet. I guess I could do white. I mean, there's yellow there too, but I mean, that's okay. Oh, I have to do upper cabinets. I don't know if I'm gonna go all the way across or just on that back wall. The only problem with these cabinets, I don't like the upper cabinets very much. I'll say it, I'm not afraid. I'm like just not a huge fan of them. I don't know. I don't know if it looks weird just being on the back wall. Cause what I was thinking is if I do that, then what I could do here is put like shelves and then just put stuff on the shelves. Cause I could do something like that. I have no idea if this is like good. <laughs> I can't even get anything on the shelves. What do you mean? Just this? Just a rose. What about any of the new clutter items? Okay, I can have a mug. I can have a water bottle. Okay, what else can I have? More mugs. I mean, that technically is, that does work. Oh, I could even turn them around and get like a solid color scheme out of this. Hacks. What else can I put up here? Tissue. Okay, here we go. Some salt and pepper shakers. I mean, normally I'd like to put like, I don't know, bowls. <laughs> Something you find in a kitchen. <gasps> I actually found plates. This is a freaking miracle. Oh, I didn't even see this clutter item. This is really cute. I'm gonna have to use that somewhere. I also forgot to put a lamp in the living room. Oh my God, I'm literally all over the place. I think I gotta go with this one. Nothing matches the aesthetic more than this lamp right here. Oh my God. Oh, I was able to squeeze these candles on here. That was not easy, but I did it. I think the rose looks stupid. <laughs> it's just so random. I'm not gonna say I love that. Okay, those are some really cute cute bar stools. I'm just gonna leave this like pretty empty. Maybe I'll put something in the corner, but like it's not a very big kitchen. I honestly might just put a microwave in the corner. It's not the cutest, but wait, isn't there a pink one? That is not the pink I was hoping for. Although the cheap microwave is the perfect shade. That's fine. Okay, so in the bathrooms, I pretty much have them laid out the way I want them to be. What if I use these fun squiggly mirrors? Who's gonna stop me? There's nobody here. We'll put my handy dandy favorite item on the wall here. Toilet paper, fancy towel, some laundry necessities in some cute colors. And last but not least, a little rug to step out on so you don't slip and fall. Okay, moving on. This bedroom. Uh, shut up. This came with a bed. I have to use it. Oh my gosh, wait, what? 
It matches the funky party carpet. I don't even know what color scheme to go for in here. I might do blue and I might do these like really cute end tables. I love them. These paintings are small, but they can go above the bed. They're very cute. I don't know if there's room in here for a dresser. Like, look at this. I mean, I could like I could squeeze one in the corner. It kind of blocks the window, but I mean, this window wasn't doing much anyways. Okay, maybe I'll put the paintings behind this because I didn't put lamps on here. I wanted them to be a little mismatched. So instead above the bed, I think what I might do, might do some lights. I like these more. You know what that looks like. I'm not gonna say it, but we all know what that looks like. Should I keep it? There is also this, but that's like a lot. Like who has that many friends? All right, back to these lights I go. I'm gonna change them to be like more yellowy. Oh, Christmas. Definitely wanna try to get like a full length mirror in here. I, if I can get the mirror in here, I'll do it. And you know what? I definitely can. That fits. And then in front here, uh, I mean, I could put a TV. Might look a little bit silly, just like hanging out by itself. You know what I mean? Unless I do tiny living. Oh my gosh, this might work. This might be good. We just do white. It's kind of boring, but nah. Oh my gosh, little purses. That's cute. We'll hang that by the door. Okay, moving on to this room. Let's just knock out the bathroom pretty quick. I'm gonna want a better shower than that. Thank you very much. Okay, this room is done. I didn't do much. It's pretty basic. Okay, I just realized I didn't put a rug under this. I guess there's car. Bit, so you're fine. I'm tempted to use the same bed because it's so cute, but I will use a different one for this room, even though I very much want to use that bed again. <laughs> okay, this color scheme is really pretty soft. Maybe we can use these fun tables since we're lacking the fun bed. It matches the pink, they look good. We'll actually do the salt lamps in this one because I keep forgetting that those are a thing. Look how cool. Oh, they're so small. I don't know why, but I thought they were going to be massive. I'll do green. Why they're lizards so little? Okay. No, nope, that looks crazy. Thought that was a good idea, but it was not. We can definitely fit a full-size dresser in this room, like no problem. We might even just do it at the door. Cute. Oh, should I put a vanity in here? <gasps> that would be kind of fun. I might put the same chair from the dining room in here just because I think that looks really nice. Oh my gosh, and I know I used this item like three times and I'm gonna do it one more time. It's just, it's makeup. It's perfect. It's perfect for a vanity. And I might also use this clutter. I might use it over here actually. Oh, and I've got more makeup right here. It's a much bigger item. <laughs> Magazines, that looks really cute. Oh, we can get a painting above here. Just something small. I think that looks pretty cute. We can get a plant over here on this wall. I might do another bookshelf or something. Might actually use this one because it's pretty wide. And those are some really cute swatches in here. Maybe I'll put like a bunch of diplomas up there. Like they're very educated. Good for them. Okay, some clutter items there. And I will try to put a rug down for this one just because I feel like there's no pattern on the carpet. Like there, a rug might be too much. Here, it might work. Maybe this could work. It's just a lot of pink. Maybe like too much, dare I say. Yeah, I feel like that just looks nice. Okay, I think I am all done. What a fun apartment. Oh my God, I would love to live here. Look how fun it is. It's so pink. Like I said, this probably is not for everyone, but the beauty of that is that we all have different styles and this is mine. I really, really like it. I think it's fun. If I was living here by myself, I'd be so happy. I don't know why I'd have two beds, but whatever. My guest room for all the guests I have, which is so many. But there you go. I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. My little pink wonderland. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll speak to you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.